In this video, I'm going to show you how you can combine different H5P formats into one package. Say you want to take an existing worksheet and package it with an interactive H5P video. There's an H5P tool called Interactive Book that allows for you to do exactly this. So let me show you the steps involved. Let's open the content bank. Click on the Add button right in the top right hand corner to see the H5P options available. From the list, you want to select the interactive book. Now that we have a blank new interactive book, I'm going to call it Teamwork Notebook. You can enable a book cover if you wish. I'm going to keep it simple and leave that as unchecked. What I like to include first is the Pat's Interactive H5P video on the development stages of teamwork. A quick way to add an existing H5P is to copy and paste it over. But to do this, the H5P needs to be in your course content bank. I'm going to open the content bank in a new tab. To do this, hover your mouse over the content bank, right click and select open in a new tab. Okay, now that you're in the content bank, find the H5P of interest from the list and open it. Once the tool has opened, click on the edit option to open the editor tool. Once you're in the editor tool, click the copy button in the top right hand corner. Now let's go back to our interactive book that's open in the other tab. You will now notice the paste and replace content has been activated with the color change. We are going to click on that now to paste the interactive content. It will ask if you're sure you want to replace the content, which we are, so let's click replace content. As simple as that, the first page of our interactive book is now an interactive video. For the second page, I want to import the team charter tool. So let's add a page by clicking on the plus add page button here on the left hand navigation menu. I'm going to follow the same steps. So let's go back to the content bank, but this time I'm going to copy over the team charter tool. Click edit and then click copy in the top right hand corner. Go back to the other tab where we have the interactive book and find the paste and replace key that has been activated under the content section and click paste, the tool will be added. You can scroll to the top or to the bottom to click save. It may take a few seconds or minutes for the tool to save. You will notice that I now have an interactive book. The first page has the video and the second page has the team charter tool. But you will also notice that I forgot to give the second page a title, so I'm going to edit that. Also, the last page is a summary page that I'm thinking is not necessary. Although there is a question in the interactive video, so maybe seeing the score can be helpful. Before we make any decisions, let's first change the title of the second section. Let's click on edit again to open the editor. We need to go to page two, which is currently called untitled column. Here at the top, we need to give it a title. I'm going to say team charter. Now I can scroll up or down to click save. Hmm, I don't think the summary page is necessary, so let's remove it. Again, let's click edit to open the editor tool. This time, you want to scroll down to the bottom of the page. Click on behavioral settings and uncheck the display summary page. Now we need to save. Here is our final package. We now have an interactive book with two different H5Ps included, an interactive video and a worksheet. 